And welcome back to Select Weird Knuckles. We're in the Death Egg people, and this is probably my least favorite zone in the game aside from Sandopolis. Gee, I wonder why. Aside from Sandopolis, I mean including Sandopolis, because I hate this zone. You will see why shortly. That's why. I do not. It's it's the Metropolis zone of this game for me. I just I hate it. I actually kind of like Metropolis zone. Get out. Okay. Wait, seriously? Okay then. Well, EJ's gone again. All right, though, I guess, I, guess it's, I guess it's just me now. Oh, shit, that, that, that was not good. All right, then, um... Yeah, Death Egg Zone. Um, some... It's got some really annoying enemies like those guys. Um, it also has those electrical hazards, which, um... The, the, you know, the electric shield, the one that you, attracts the rings to you. That, it actually has a special power that it, it doesn't go away if it protects you from damage from the electric traps. Which I just came... Zone. I just went to Mars and back. I feel so alive. Cool story, bro. <laughs> um, so as I was saying, that the electric shields makes you immune to those electric hazards, and it doesn't go away when it protects you from them. Kind of like how the fire shield does that for fire, and the water shield you breathe in water. But it's only way. ever used in this one zone. It's never used ever at all in the game aside from that. Oh yeah. By the way, I brought you back this from space. Cool. Space rock. Take it. Thank you. Also, this. <laughs> What the fuck is happening? Seizure Jenkins! So, yeah. It's gonna be a very interesting playback. Motherfucker. We've almost been going for an hour. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Bad Nick bouncing. Well, it's not really bad Nick bouncing because it's not bad Nick's. It's spring box things. 35 rings and a lightning shield is actually pretty good for the zone. So, do you want to hear about my adventure on Mars? I'd rather not. I found a Darla there. I mean, a Dalek. Dalek. That's Dalek. Dalek. I can't pronounce anything. No, you can't. I was called Dalek. You also can't do a British accent very well. We established that. I was. I was called Daleks. Okay then. Because that's the way I always heard it. That's the way I always thought it sounded like. Yeah, because British accents. Oh, Dalek. 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 The question is though, could you spell it? Fanga puppet. Fanga puppet. The question is though, could you spell Dalek? Um, D, A, Flam. Ah, come the dead terrorist, everybody! Silence! I, I see you! More references! Who the crap are you? That was a terrible. Awkward. Geronimo! Ah! Fuck. You had blood, you got sniped. Yep. I got snaped. Welcome, welcome to our let's play of Call of Duty Sonic the Hedgehog, ladies and gentlemen. No, but it was called Duty Sock the Hedgehog and I went on Quick Quickscoped. Oh. Fucking Quickscopes. Fucking hate Quickscopers, I really do. Yeah, that's the reason why you do it all the time. I right. don't. I don't Quickscope. That's also the reason why you screen hop. Don't ask like- don't act like you don't, you screen hop. Yes. Yes, when we're playing split screen. Alright, um, so that was a little bit of an annoying section back there, where you have to bounce and hit that thing in the center in each of those six places. Yeah. Um, it, it can be annoying your first time playing if you don't know how to do it. 3D! Again. Ow. Ow. That's why I hate this zone. There's so many hazards that you just can't avoid. I really need to get hypersonic by the end of this zone, guys. I'm, I'm just gonna say that. If I don't get hypersonic by the end of this zone, I'm gonna be screwed on the boss. At least by the end of this act, rather. Brian, Wind doesn't like, like to screw you over. Um, it always likes to screw me over. Okay, we're good. We got a bunch of rings here. Boing. A boingy. A boingy. Oh my god, seizures! Oh yeah, I'm not to put seizure warning in like all of these videos because of Hypersonic. Oh my god! So that was a pretty easy boss. Oh wait, there's more! I said seizure. Oh turns, turns my god! Turn, beats boss, turns into Billy Mays, but wait, there's more! <laughs> Still a pretty easy boss if you have hypersonic. Without hypersonic, it's it's difficult. But hopefully you have hypersonic like I do. Where's Pikachu? Um, I don't know. Bye Tails! Why do you even ask that? Good question. Also, why can I breathe in space but not underwater? Ah. Uh... We were close enough to the Earth's atmosphere that we- We're not! Uh... We can see the goddamn Earth! Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is Mobius. 
Oh yeah. Who says Moise doesn't just have a great But mass. you can see in the background there, guys. That's something? clearly North America down there. Wait, what? Right there, that's that's Canada. Or maybe it's not. I don't fucking know. <laughs> okay, hold on. So, hold on. We're in Mobius. Who says Mobius doesn't just have a greater mass? So that way the atmosphere can spread out farther. Okay. Therefore, you can go farther into space and still breathe. That almost makes sense. Suck it, Mad Pat! Oh, no, give me back my Majora's mask, damn it! No. What? Oh, good god, that was close. You want to lose your rings? No, because I want to go hypersonic, and I also lost my electric shield, which is really bad in this zone! Those vacuums? Yeah, this is the only this is the only zone where you actually get hit by a bunch of attacks, isn't it? Yeah, I already went over that while you were gone. Oh. I did something to talk about, so I talked about it. Yeah, so I went to Mars. Don't be surprised if you see me in the background, because yeah. <laughs> yeah see, I, now I just need to edit a picture of you into the background <laughs> of this video. <laughs> just like just floating along the screen. Hi oh, guys! <laughs> Like, as soon as you say that, as soon as you say that, I need to do that. Uh, I'm kidding, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> that would be rings, be beautiful, beautiful over there. That would be beautiful. That would be epic. Anyway. Uh, this this zone is really difficult, for a fi it's, but it's a good it's good for a final zone. I think they did a pretty good job with it for a final yeah, zone. Right. Oh yeah, by the way, I met an alien. His name was Tom. It's pretty cool. Yeah, we bought lunch with Taco Bell. Oh shit, that's bad, that's bad. I should've gone hyper, I should've gone hyper. We wanted the space Taco Bell. It's pretty cool. God tells can't break item boxes. So yeah, we went to uh, went to Space Taco Bell. It was pretty tasty. Four tails, so I can get those two rings down there. <laughs> Fucking cheater. What cheating? It's called taking advantage. You could ask door. me to do it. Yeah, but you suck, and I don't trust you to do it. I don't trust you to get two rings. <laughs> you know what? I'm still gonna have to like if we ever like show off knuckles and tails in this game. Yeah. I am going to prove you wrong. I'm going to kick ass in this game with tails. Haha, <laughs> no. Oh wait, you were serious? Let me laugh even harder. So where's the doctor when you need him? Probably off saving the world from Daleks. But we need the world to be saved from a fat bastard. Well, Sonic's handling that. I'm sure the doctor just doesn't seem to find it necessary to do it if Sonic can. It's Sonic being controlled by you. Good point. Doctor, we need you. Sonic Doctor Who crossover. Activate now. That would be awesome. Why is that not happening? Fanfic scheme. It exists. New rule of the internet, if it exists, there's a fanfic of it. Well, according to Sonic Shits, there was a Sonic and the Lion King crossover. I'm not making it up. Furry Hamlet? Furry Hamlet. Furry Hamlet indeed. Furry Hamlet. Furry Hamlet everywhere. Canes. Canes everywhere. If you get that reference, congratulations, you got another cookie. No, they got a brownie point. Collect ten to collect ten brownie points, you get a brownie. Okay then, that's one. Yeah. Oh, uh, that was that was close, that was close. I'm gonna hold on to my rings here. Like, really, really badly. Bye tails! I really need to keep my rings here. I cannot afford to lose it at this point. What the hell's Tails doing? God only knows. <laughs> so yeah, I think we're, uh... Are we on the, uh... Satellite laser cannon from Akira? Uh, any minute now, Tattoo's gonna fly up here, punch a hole in this thing, and use the materials to make a new arm. Alright, I have enough rings and I have a lightning shield. That is extremely good. Damn, that is so good, you have no idea. And then Tetsuo blows up the death end. Oh god, that's bad. That is very bad. My um, my mood just changed completely in like two seconds. What am I now, a woman? You're PMSing. I apologize to all my female viewers. All one of you. Yeah. Um, you know I think this is going to be the one I don't like! Ah, gumballs! Rings! And bubble shield, apparently. What the fuck happened there? I fell. I got a bubble shield. No, no, no! It's just that you fell through like 50 power ups. Alright, I have a bubble shield. Let's do this. I don't like this boss. Well, it looks like Eggman's deformed son. So you guys just drop the spikes back, back down on it? Yep. Either when you change the gravity and they can fall on it, or when it's stuck in the ceiling, if you spin back into it, it'll get shot up into him. If you time it right, that'll happen. Hey. 
Also, if you hit it, it doesn't. If you hit it when it's um, stuck in the ground and it doesn't hit him again, it doesn't hit him. It'll flip over. I have a question: How does that change the gravity? I thought it changed Sonic and Tails' personal gravity. No, it changes. It apparently, changes. But it doesn't change the gravity for, gravity for Eggman, apparently. Yeah. Which I will never understand. It's a gravity chamber, I guess. Maybe Eggman has a little section placed over there with artificial gravity in it. And Sonic and Tails just don't. Yeah. His artificial gravity is separate from ours. Hypersonic here, just to be, be safe, because I don't want to lose my rings. Because your rings carry over to the next boss if you do it in one life. So if you don't do it in one life, they don't carry over to the next boss. So why don't, uh, why doesn't, uh, why didn't the boss music speed up there? Um, I don't know. So when do we get to Doomsday Zone? Um, after the final, after the boss of Death Egg Zone. You don't say. So yeah, first we need to do this boss, and hopefully, I, I have Hypersonic this time, which means I should be able to do it. I can't do it as regular Sonic very easily, but I can do it with Hypersonic. So anyway, our boss of this zone is Humpty Dumpty. Yeah, the, the boss needs to speed up for some reason, I don't know why. Anyway, meet the final boss of the game, ladies and gentlemen, Humpty Dumpty. The final boss, if you don't have all the Super Emeralds, this is the final boss. It's Humpty Dumpty! If you don't have all the Chaos Emeralds or Super Emeralds, this is the final boss. It's if freaking you have, Humpty Dumpty. If you have either all seven Chaos Emeralds or all seven Super Emeralds, um, even if you don't have all the Super Emeralds, if you at least got the Chaos Emeralds, you'll be alright. Alright, Brian and Bye. What's that from? Uh, that was from Sonic the Pyro. Oh, yeah. I think right. Tails, kind of, Tails is kind of raping me. Yeah, that's pretty good. So, can I help here? No. Okay. I can, I can do it just fine on my own. Thank you very much. Okay, then. Now you got all the Super Emeralds, you don't need anybody. Yep. The world. And Eggman still has the Master Emeralds, we must stop him! Knuckles, quick, break it! Break it like you did in Adventure 1, in Adventure 2! Oh my god, it literally is the exact same machine as Adventure 1! Oh my god, uh, this don't is- fall off, damn it! No, it's, I mean, Adventure 2. Okay, that's don't like fall five, off, I need, damn to, it. I need to keep back my hits to make sure I don't fall off on the final hit. That's six. Tails died, that's really good for me, actually. <laughs> Eight. Good. Okay. good. Alright, Death Egg Zone completes, now on to De Doomsday Zone, which is all gonna be the same parts because why the fuck not, and we're hypersonics, and it's so this. intense. Let's end this. Alright, so first things first, you wanna stay over to the left, avoid the boulders, and collect rings, because if you run out of rings, you die. It's just like the final boss of most modern Sonic games. I have a question. Yep. Can you do this boss with, uh, Super Knuckles and Super Tails? I don't know. I actually have no idea. We must figure this out. I don't think you can- I don't think you do, actually. I think, uh, Knuckles and Tails automatically end after Death Egg Zone. I don't think- I think only Sonic can go to the Doomsday Zone. Anyway, we are flying through space. If you hit the missiles, they will send you backwards. If you hit the asteroids, they will slow you down. If you collect rings, you get more rings. Your rings drain like they normally do as Hyper or Supersonic. Um, if you lose your rings, you die. You ruin the This zone is exactly the same if you're a Hyper or Supersonic. Um... It's, and, but technically getting hypersonic is the true good ending. Okay, so we're flying through space avoiding chicken nuggets and dildo rockets. Pretty much. <laughs> that's, that's seriously what- How many dick jokes are we gonna make in this let's play? Um, All right, 69. now, th this boss. Seriously. <laughs> Alright, so this boss, we can't actually hurt this boss, we have to lure his heat-seeking missiles into him. Seeking missiles. We have to lure the missiles into him as hypersonic, which is quite annoying. I have a question: Does the giant egg robot have its own egomatic? Okay, I it's don't... a giant. It's a giant egomatic. It might. That's seriously what the blue thing is. It's just a giant egomatic. That's the goal to lure the missiles into him. So anyway, we've got giant Robotnik flying in a giant egomatic. Wow, right, well, I assume his giant supersonic flies into him. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That is the end of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. No, it isn't. What's left? This! He's not dead! Once again, hold back and get your rings back, because you probably lost a lot during that fight, because there were none. That's why I wanted you to get rings at the beginning, Look. because you do need a lot of rings. If you don't have any, and you just have around 50, you're probably going to lose them. So make sure you get up to around 70 or 80 rings. Here, you want to get a bunch before you move after him. Um, once you hit him, you get sent back, and you just have to go towards him and hit him again. I recommend holding back for a bit and getting your rings back a little bit at least. Um, to around 50 before you get back, go back, go and try to hit him. So anyway, can I ask a question? Yes. Why doesn't Sonic just hurl the meteors at him? Um, that would be too easy. Alright, let's go for it. Ow. When you get close <laughs> to him, he will start dropping he bombs behind right him. right into that. You're close to him, he starts dropping bombs behind him, then you have to try to hit him. Sonic slammed right into that, uh, chicken nugget there. So you have to try to get close and then hit him, which is not very easy to do. 
You have to hold right to move forward, which makes it harder to move on the asteroids, though. I think I got like two hits so far. Let's hold back and get some more range. How many hits does this dumbass take? Eight. Uh, oh my god, are you fucking serious? This is a freaking marathon boss. I know, it's so long. But it's it's worth it. It's You gotta save the world. You save the world! No, this is not the awesome series. Sonic 3 awesome. So Sonic awesome. Sonic 3 and no Sonic 3 and awesome? Sonic 3 and awesome. Okay, sure. You have to get on that shit, please? Yes, please. Quit Game Grumps. Leave it all to Danny. First, there was John. First, John left. And then Aaron left. And then there was Daddy. And Barry. 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 Say it with me. Barry. Say it with me. Lenny Pator. Damn it! Lenny Pator. Since when did I give permission to make parodies that I've already made? Um, you didn't. I just took them. Because fuck your shit. No, I. God damn it! This is my house. This is my room. No, 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 Sato, say it with me. Talk the words. Lanny Pator. Lanny Pator. What was that? What episode was that from, anyways? That was from uh, when that was from when Kai was trying to figure out his own, his real father, and then it turns out he's a robot. But what does the Lanny Pator thing come from? That's when he's talking to Pegasus. And what? Who is Lanny Pator? He uh, worked on the abridged version of. Uh, Ruru Haka Show. Yeah. I guess I pronounce it anyway. I haven't watched the show, so don't don't get on me about that. So yeah, Ooh. this is a rather long boss. It is a difficult one. It's, I guess you could say it's kind of long and hard. More dick jokes, haha. I told you we were gonna get. We're so right? immature. I told you we were gonna get the 69 jokes. We are dick so immature. I told you we were gonna get the 69 dick jokes at the end of this. I wasn't fucking around. That wasn't a joke. I'm serious. Ah, stop hitting the bombs. So anyway. Are we gonna reach for the stars? Alright, future me in editing, put that song in here. Okay, sure. You better actually do it right. Yeah. Just mute our audio, just put it in here. Yeah. I'll be fine. We'll not, we'll not mute our audio, we'll mute the game audio. We'll put that in for like two seconds. Look at all that flying. We're flying through chicken McNuggets in space over an endless valley of blue. And as with any level in the game, you have to beat it within 10 minutes or you get a time over. Uh, uh, this takes forever! It's worse than Sand Obelisk. Yes! Okay, good. And we did it! Very good, the game's over. Yep, that is it. And like any good let's play, we need to talk during the credits. Well, first of all, just listen to Carl's music for a bit. Be quiet here. Alright, so basically, if you beat if you beat the Doomsday Zone as either Super or Hypersonic, you get the Master Emerald. If you don't beat the Doomsday Zone, if you don't have all the Chaos Emeralds, then you lose the Master Emeralds, but you still beat at Robotnik. You'll get a you'll get a screen saying try again with Eggman breaking his back trying to lift up the Master Emerald. Yes, because he still has the Master Emerald. Yeah. So anyway. When um, it was, this is the true good ending. You yeah. can only get this good ending by getting all the super emeralds and master emeralds and chaos emeralds and uh, oh soul God, emeralds that's and magic right, tampons terrible. and world rings and screw. Let's just call him Jesus. Zero the Hedgehog. No, screw. Let's just call it Jesus. Sonic the Hedgehog three and knuckles. Yep. So as with any good let's play, we need to talk about how the let's play went during the credits. No, I think we gotta put our final thoughts on the game. So what did you think of the game? Well, it's pretty fucking awesome. Yeah, it's, it's Sonic. It's Sonic. You gotta go fast. Now, I'm just gonna say something right now. It's never a good Sonic, but I do think Sonic 3 and Knuckles is a pretty good game. So, yeah. Right away, you think of this game. Oh, wait, wait, I ask you that. Yeah, it's, it's, and it's a great game. Echo the Dolphin. Also, here it'll play through all the different music from the game. It's pretty cool. Yep. So, okay. So, right, I didn't let's play once. Um, it, it had its bumps, but it went pretty well overall. Yeah. I think. Aside from all the fuck ups, mm -hmm. upon fuck ups, upon fuck ups, yep. upon fuck ups, upon right, fuck ups. We get the idea, EJ. Upon fuck ups. So, what do you think our next let's play is gonna be? And this is just huh. some ideas. Super Mario World? And I don't know. We did Sonic. We did the best 2D Sonic game, so why don't we do the best 2D Mario game? Think about it. I was trying to think of a, of a joke to make of like saying, what, what, you mean insert really bad 2D Mario game here? But I Wait, you mean Mario's missing? Yes! Okay. 
Wait, is there a next one? There's gonna be Mario missing, everybody. Yay! No, but in all seriousness, I think we should do a holiday special next. Like, yeah, a yeah, holiday like, special, in the, but for our next real Let's Play, what do you think that should be? Okay. I'll think here. Let's see, so we did Sonic 3. Oh, I remember what we were gonna do. You were gonna do Mega Man 1, right? Yes, Mega Man 1. Okay, I need to learn that game, because I still can't beat the fucking Yellow Devil! Yellow Devils. God damn you, Yellow, yellow devils. devils everywhere. God damn you, Yellow Devil, why are you so hard? Yellow Devils. Yellow Devils everywhere. <laughs> God damn you, Yellow Devil, why are you so hard? Okay, so Just yeah. use the pause trick. I tried, it didn't help. Well, how'd you do it? I, actually, I never really got to the boss there. I'll, I'll try it soon, like, after we finish recording this. Ryan, you're a lying bastard. You totally got to the Yellow Devil. I did, just not that time. Yeah. Also, I like how Tails... I like how Noe's hair moves in this entire thing. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Like, they're, they're moving at, like, 10,000 miles an hour, and their hair isn't moving. I guess Tails is, is kind of moving. Also, here's a question. How is Sonic not falling off the plane? Uh, he does that in this, and in Sonic 2, and in Sonic Adventure, and I don't think he does it in Adventure 2 or Heroes. Uh, he does it in the beginning of Lost World. Um, he does it... Does he just have glue on his feet? He does it in Sonic X. He's just... He, do, he does a thing. He kind of does it in Sonic Adventure? Tails even installed an arm to get Sonic out of the way. Yeah, talking about thinking ahead. Yeah. And I guess that's the end of the credits. Almost. Is this how it ends, Ryan? Is it over? And with that, thank you all for watching. That is the end of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. <laughs> oh, what a dead. It was too fun. Me neither. Actually, you know what? <laughs> and there will be bonus episodes. This isn't the end. We okay. will... We'll just leave it on this screen for a bit while we talk. Uh, there will be some bonus episodes. No, Ryan, um, I think we should just stop and let this set in. Okay, we're done. <laughs> Alright, um, there will be bonus episodes, um, specifically of me playing through some of the- showing off what you can do after you beat the game. Yay, we're going again! Um, Yay! After, after you beat the game, now I have two complete save files. Okay. Complete all the save files! So, yeah, yeah I um, guess we're done. And this one has more lives and a continue, get owned previous save file. So what, you just owned yourself in the past? So yeah, you can go- TO THE TARDIS! Okay, that's enough Doctor Who references for one day. Okay, got it. Um, you can, uh, we watch the credits, or you can also play through any zone you want with all the Super Emeralds. You can Let's get, play God. You can get Hypersonic in Sonic 3 Special Stages. You can also do that in Debug Mode, but I'm not gonna show off Debug Mode just yet. That'll be for another episode. So I guess we're done. Yeah, that'll be it for this episode. Uh, we will come back to this in some bonus episodes soon. Thank you all so much for watching, and we will see you all in the bonus episodes. Goodbye.